Okay, so right now we're gonna antifreeze a 4018 jetting machine. Um, it's really simple to antifreeze. The first thing you wanna do is you wanna shut off your water valve here, and then you wanna open your water valve here. So you're gonna shut off your water valve and you're gonna open your antifreeze valve. Um, once you got your antifreeze valve open, you're gonna, you're gonna open your primer valve and you're gonna suck the antifreeze through here. So once, you, once this turns a little green, you're able to close it at that point and then you should, your pump is antifreeze and you should be antifreeze right now on this side of it. So we're gonna, we're gonna antifreeze, now that you got the front um, set up, we're gonna antifreeze the hose. So what you wanna do is you wanna hold your hose in your hand, you're gonna crank your machine and you're gonna turn your water on. You're gonna use the water to allow you to push the antifreeze through the system, all right? Turn my water on. Once the once the color changes green, I know I'm antifreeze uh, in my hose. And you can see the water start to change. Now we're we're antifreeze. So now what I want to do is I want to antifreeze my water return lines. So I'm going to open this line, I'm going to get antifreeze to it, and I'm going to open this line, my pulsation, just to get antifreeze to it, and I'm going to shut my machine down. Last step you want to do, which is very important, is you want to back feed the antifreeze to your, uh, water, your water supply line. So what I want to do is I want to come here and open this water valve, just crack it a little bit, get some antifreeze into this line and, uh, and then close this valve again so that this line doesn't freeze. All right, so I'm gonna open this, I'm gonna back feed a little bit and then I'm gonna shut this, va this, this valve right back. All right, so now at this point, my unit is completely antifreeze and I'm good to go. I can leave it outside for the night.